Any rebels? No. So the pop over has 25 tech admin and 25 tech military, 24 diplomacy. This is pretty nice. We're gonna steal tech from the Pope again. We're gonna steal tech from the Popo. Just lose the money. Well, we want money to embrace the institution, right? It's spreading though, it's spreading like, like crazy. Okay. So they discovered us, which is not very sexy. to the crop he has him he has a good general No peace for you.
Okay, so this war is pretty stupid. We don't want army tradition right now. So let's just lose prestige so that we don't lose any money. This war is fucking stupid. Crap! Fuck my life. There's a fort there. Maybe we could go for that. Are we closer to the institution? Yes, we are. So it's pretty close to being done almost everywhere. Due to the universities we build in... Uh, <coughs> last time. Fucking hell. Yeah, we lost fucking troops. I hate losing troops because I have to reinforce them again and stuff like that. I don't mind losing manpower that much. Now I'll probably need another army. Um. I should have sent another army earlier. I was too lazy to do this war correctly. <laughs> but yeah, fucking hell. I mean, Castile could have helped too. But they're fucking around. What? Oh crap. We can't make them course? Can force fossilize them. Can't ask for anything. <clears throat> oh, I can give them to Castile, right? Let's do that. Castile. Okay. Can I ask for it now? Yes, thank you very much. Not fucking California. Whatever.
Hmm. Well, we are going to fight later in the game, not now. So... What if I actually disinherit him? He's pretty old too. this fucking what okay Can embrace the institution. Oh, this is all diplomatic power. Oh. Come on. Okay, thank you. Oh, okay. I see how this is. So if we take them from the main co-belligerent, well, is this a good still? I think it's kind of okay. It doesn't have that much aggressive expansion. Then it's going by it's September 26. We can attack them then. Okay, let's uh, maybe not yet. We can't buy any text yet, so no point in doing it now. Four years until we can change thingy. The next peace treaty ends on 21 with France. Yes, we want the administrative power. Thank you very much, Sklerzi. Hmm. 
1783? <laughs> it's not right. So do we have a revolutionary France now? Is that it? French revolutionaries. So the revolution begins. How do you trigger the revolution? Stability less than zero. Cossacks gain influence, everyone becomes sad. Cossacks lose influence and they become sad. Can I exploit the Cossacks before that for something? Sure, let's take their tradition thingy and then make them sad. <laughs> They'll recover, it's okay. Good big boys. So it is getting cheaper and cheaper. No, I don't think it's going to get any cheaper than this anytime soon. No, let's just embrace it. No, I think it's a good point. Cultural conversion cost. Okay, pretty good. So, are we the last to embrace it again? Yeah, pretty much. And it spawned in fucking Brunei, man, really. What is this crap? Okay, so what? So they actually won't join, either they. Yeah, again. So, last time them joining was just a weird thing. So what do we have to deal with now? Mombasa, allied to Kilba. Granting the independence of Ethiopia. Hey, that's something we can change. Where's that ship? Just go there. Get a good general there. Oh, right, this guy. Sink him somewhere there again. Well, you shouldn't have guaranteed in Ethiopia, man. Should not have done this. Well, what religion is Ethiopia? We can destroy the Coptics, totally. The Copts. So, yeah, we can get Mombasa out of the coalition. Pretty much dominating Africa... ...would be good. I should have done it earlier. But... What happened was that... Religious hmm. What happened was that um, I changed my eyes to Europe and then, yeah, we didn't finish with the Muslim coalitions. Which kind of made it hard to tackle the European coalitions at a lot of points in time. Can I fabricate now? No, I don't want to fabricate. What am I saying? We want the tech reduction cost. Tech, tech cost reduction. December of uh, 1716. Wait, what? Oh crap! I didn't move the guy. Can I move him from land? No. Okay, let's fight like this. It's pretty much done deal. Any mothballed forts? It's mothballed. This is mothballed. This is mothballed. Any other mothballed forts? This is mothballed. So actually... You go for this one, you go for this one. This guy goes for that one. Any other mothballed forts? 
we maintained capital no yep it's gonna take him a fuck ton of time no stay there in Corfu that's okay Oh right, we can do our beloved workshops level 2. Now he has alliance with Kilva and look at this is free. Kilva might get a bit angry with us. This is mothballed, this is mothballed, this is mothballed and there's no forts there but let's try this Well, I would very much like to do this for the <laughs> for the meme, <laughs> but I'll just gain five prestige. I don't want to waste fifty admin power. I don't know if this is an event line, and I don't have time to check it now. If I was playing single player, I would check it, but I'll just take the prestige now. Oh wow. Come on. And we were just about to win this. So we lost that mothballed fort. It's actually still at zero garrison, but we can't reach there in time. Let's get a good general there. 12th of December. What? Come on! I was trying to check the military status. That's not fucking fair. Where's she going? Five of July. 10 of April Yeah, you know what, maybe I shouldn't fucking underestimate Enemies, maybe um, I'll take the plus one stability 
and go to stability 3. Thank you very much. Take the monarch power. Go attack him now. So we actually kind of beat most of this crap. Oh, he's full again. How much fucking army does this guy have? Mombasa. So was was he like one of the big ones my god he had something like 80 90 thousand troops during the coalition war oh we got the seeds getting there first he's getting there first probably so maybe we shouldn't fight him like this so we should stay there get him a good general or a decent one at least oh my god they're winning on their own The Commonwealth came to the rescue. <laughs> Is this army down? Yeah, they're ready. So, we can purchase an ability. Well... Let's take this one. Harsh discipline, great leader. The fact that we can't have rivals should give us power projection. I think. So the commonwealth is engaging, which is very good for us. Let's try this. Oh, crap. Why are they so angry? Diplomatic tech, probably... Um, diplomatic reputation? No. It says Byzantine... Doesn't say diplomatic reputation. 
oh it says minus six percent then relative power okay of course an opinion well we can do something about opinion and then okay i'll take the tech now and change them to orthodox opinion changed okay Nice, great air, great queen. Go there, we'll need to fight France soon. Hmm. So France became revolutionary. He still hates us. <laughs> okay. Well, there's been a lot of silence in this uh, last uh, minutes of gameplay. I didn't have a lot to say. It's a pretty boring war that I made. Um, that I've made wars with my. with my weak gameplay.
So he wants to get there before me. Fuck you. We lost an advisor. Um, let's get... Let's get another diplomat. It's not only the money that we gain, but I want to improve relations thingy. Because uh, I've seen that a lot of Sunni nations are actually kind of getting out of the aggressive expansion thingy. They're becoming a bit more chill. So... Let's get these guys back, we don't need them there anymore. Oh, hey! Uh, it stopped being of value now. Now it's just a meme. We're just doing it for the, for the lulz. What's up with the fucking Holy Roman Empire? So they are orthodox and they're happy about it. And they're becoming more happy as time goes by. Now are they converting anything? I think they're not converting. It's on their... Uh, yeah. They're not converting. They went full humanist and they don't care. Not converting anything. <laughs> Classic Commonwealth. Oh, Russia is fighting. That's great. I hope they win against Sweden. Sweden is very irritating. To fight against. Now, should I like leave my vassals to the... No. Can I go down there? No. So, I'll just go for the fort. And leave my vassals to the other kind of occupations. Or I can just get land now. So if I get only Sunni land, almost no one almost no one is angry about this. We'll see. If I ask them from him, yeah, I'm losing diplomatic power that way, so I'm not going to do it. Because we have imperialism casus belli now. If we take uh, land from the main co belligerent, or from any co belligerent, if we ask them from land, uh, we don't pay diplomatic reputation with diplomatic power. Uh, that's another advantage of the Holy War, Casus Belli. Did we get the fort instantly? <laughs> Let's ask for the coastal ones. These ones.
Well, I think I like this uh, distribution of land that we ask for. Maybe just ask for the full coast. I'm not going to ask for this part of the coast I'm going to ask for some mountainous regions here Yeah, I think that's better So, some ducats um, I think I'll convert first or no You know what, I'll convert the... High development ones. These are not the high development ones. Okay, we've made some mistake, okay. Let's start from the beginning. First of all, we're missing one missionary, right? Well, it's okay. So, we'll core all the cheap ones first. One, two, three, four, five. And then we'll convert what's left, which is probably the high development ones. And now we have a new better spot to rest our army. What? Oh. Slavery, right. So... Oh, I didn't check when the pistol with uh, Mombasa ends. 34, okay, that's good, because now... First of all, we could attack Makuria. Why would we want to, though? What am I saying? Now Kilva is not going to join a coalition when it's formed. Bengal is another problem. The Mamluks have no alliances, of course. Russia and Sweden. Sweden has an alliance with Wurzburg and the Papal State. And for some reason, Wurttemberg isn't going to join either. But he's a puppet. Okay, what if we try to improve relations with some of this folk? No, uh, it won't work because we want to take stuff from France and Portugal, so the Europeans are constantly going to be angry at us. We don't want to, them to stop being angry at us. Where's this guy? This guy's there.
How strong is Dutch Mexico compared to our Dutch Mexico? 26,000. Byzantine West Indies, 19,000. Well, at least they're making stuff orthodox. Okay, I think I'm going to stop here, guys. Uh, see you next time in.